Hey, welcome back, guys. There's some news from Arcade One Up, and there's just been a lot going on lately. I guess everybody has to get to these holiday releases eventually, and folks are teeing up products accordingly. There are pre order links for Ms. Pac Man and X Men vs. Street Fighter. That's been out for a little while, but this is an email notification Arcade One Up just sent to their subscribers. I encourage you to subscribe to their email list if you're a fan of the products. But I wanted to go through this. There actually is something new here. Ms. Pac-Man, I guess let's go through one by one. So we know Ms. Pac-Man, X-Men vs. Street Fighter cabinets. Look, I've shared my opinion on these. Um, you know, everybody's different because it's going to come down to your game room or your room or wherever you're putting this. That's going to define, do you want the stand-up cabinet? Do you want the countercade? Do you want the cocktail? We're getting choices with Ms. Pac-Man. You can see it's coming in all three varieties. I love the design of the Ms. Pac-Man stand-up. It looks gorgeous. Maybe one of their best looking cabinets yet. Riser design on point. Very cool. I don't like the games list. And I know a lot of people look past that games list because it's Ms. Pac-Man. The cabinet looks so cool. And if that works for you, that's awesome. I'm not begrudging this product. Um, I just think that this cocktail cabinet and its games list is so dope. that, that I mean, that's the way to go. But I have room for one more cocktail cabinet. I currently have one, the Street Fighter Black Series. And I like it, so I'm I'm cool with getting a second one. But not everyone wants to have a cocktail cabinet or has room for it, so I get that. I do kind of wish we could get that games list in the stand-up, because honestly, then I might get the stand-up too, because it does look good. Although I like how the cocktail looks. Um, looking at the countercades, Ms. Pac-Man and Pac-Man 40th. Like, these kind of are what they are. Um, I think Cool Toy did a review on the Ms. Pac-Man. It looks good. I, I didn't even watch that video, to be fair. Uh, nothing against Cool Toy. He makes really good content. But this thing just, it, it's like a toy. Like, it's so small. It's so lightweight. And um, I, I just don't see myself getting one. I think if I had a bar at home, I'd probably get one just for the novelty because I have so many Arcade One Up products. That I might buy this, but I don't think I'd be that excited about it, if that sounds weird. I, I really think when you look at the bar top opportunities through, like, iArcade and stuff... Those look just more legit. This is something I could see, like, if I had a kid at home, maybe buy one of these. It's just not, it doesn't do it for me. But, hey, to each their own. If you're into it, it's all good. We got options. All right, so here's what I really wanted to get to. Ms. Pac-Man Cocktail, Pac-Man 40th. It's been rumored that there'd be a Pac-Man 40th. I think it popped up at maybe Best Buy.com or one of these retailers, but the listing didn't have any images. So this image is interesting because we see that awesome Ms. Pac-Man print, but there's seemingly nothing on the Pac-Man 40th, so what's that about? Well, let's click through and take a look. All right, so we're here at the head-to-head -head options. This is at arcade1up.com, so definitely take a look for yourself. The Pac-Man 40th doesn't have a design on it. Um, I'm kind of surprised by that. It has the yellow bezel. I, I should note, by the way, these cocktail cabs have real team molding, or at least all the ones I've ever seen, so I assume these ones are real team molding too, which is neat. And I know there were old school cocktail cabinets who really didn't have anything going on the side like Frogger and stuff. So this this might not be super inauthentic. The topper looks cool, by the way, and that's where you're getting your design. I'm a little surprised they went without anything. It's kind of a minimalist look. It's all right. I don't have a problem with it, but, you know, it doesn't look as good as that Ms. Pac-Man. That Ms. Pac-Man is for sure the winner visually as far as I'm concerned. They are 29 inches tall. Now, I have covered that previously. That's a revelation. The old tables were 25 inches. I would put mine to 32 inches, which was the original arcade height. But 29 is probably tall enough. I probably wouldn't put any feet under this personally. Have my stools here, and you're good to go. But let's look at this games list. So the Pac-Man 40th cocktail has pac and Pal, Pac-Man Plus, Super Pac-Man, Pac-Mania, Pack Land, Galaga, and Galaxian, cool. Uh, Dig Dug and Dig Dug 2. So, I mean, pretty pretty similar lineup to the Ms. Pack, man. So, we got options. Um, my guess is the Ms. Pack is going to sell way more. One, it looks more interesting. And it two, it's Ms. Pack, man. I think there's just more pent up demand for that because historically we haven't had options to buy it in a large. You could get the little super mini micro arcade. But for something of decent size, you really couldn't. Now, if we look at the countercade options, then this is referencing that Pac-Man 40th countercade. So if you're into that, you could pick it up. Again, just not really for me, but, you know, to each their own. 
So those are the main things. It's been covered before. X-Men uh, versus Street Fighter is available to pre-order. Let's see if this link is working now. It's It's gone on and off. So this is up for pre-order. I will put a link below. Um, I guess the main story from that email notice that they just sent out then is Ms. or is the regular Pac-Man 40th anniversary head-to-head. -head. Let me know below in the comments which ones you plan to pick up. Are you going cocktail? If you are, are you going for the 40th or do you want Ms. Pac? Or are you more interested in getting the Ms. Pac-Man stand-up cabinet? That's going to be the battle this year. I, I, I'd love to see sales figures on these guys' products because I'm curious what shakes out as more important. Anyway, super quick update for you. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Dripping lights, paint the skies, only